Hey everyone, this is Shirkat from Void Coders. Uh, so, as you already know, that Elementor has released a 2.0 for their pro version, which includes the theme builder. So, what it will let you do is um, create your WordPress sites, header, footer, archive pages, single block pages, and a whole lot of different things. Uh, but I'm not going to go into details about those. Today I'm making this video for the beginners who want to build their header and footer with uh, this new Elementor 2.0. So let's get started. So here I have a site which has this uh, 2017 theme by default. So uh, now let us begin building the header. I'm gonna go to my templates remember you will need the Elementor Pro version 2.0 for this so I'm gonna go to header I'm gonna create a new header I'm gonna name it my new header I create template I find this absolutely fascinating you know so when you click this, uh, you are going to have a, a window with uh, two pre-built blocks for headers. You can just uh, insert from them or you can just click cross and make your own. Uh, just like you would have done it like this, say, nav menu, okay, on the left maybe a logo right so i'm not gonna go do that i'm just gonna import the import the block which already is designed so there you have it now uh this is an image wizard as you know so we can make it dynamic uh so that your site's logo which you upload in your customizer setting uh, gets there so we can click on this dynamic option and select this site logo see so i don't have the site logo right now so this is showing me this uh, placeholder image if i upload the site logo it will automatically get inherited here and here we have this uh, the menu so like, i'm going to change it a bit i am gonna delete this uh, other box there I'll make the logo smaller and so there we have it okay so you see also this logo is now connected to the site url okay so if we click publish we are gonna get presented with a window where we can add conditions so what this will do is allow you to add different kind of conditions for different pages say you want to build a header and show it in only one specific page or one specific custom post type you can do that now with this so i'm gonna go ahead and uh, choose enter site so this will be shown site wide so i'm gonna click publish now if i visit my site As you can see the header is already here so I'm gonna change the logo I'm gonna go to customizer and I'm gonna go to site identity select the logo uh, I don't know if I have any good logos around here ah let's say I'm gonna use this let's keep copying boom there you go pretty cool right so now if you go to any page you are going to see this header there ah I'm sorry that uh, took me to another post ah see that's a awesome now let's go ahead and build a footer with this so the footer also works in the same way we're gonna go to the footer 
add new name it with my footer create template and we are gonna get, get presented with beautiful blocks of footer here I'm gonna insert one so let's change the color a bit maybe red okay so the text color maybe one right I don't need this there I'll make this align the center and this is how I comes to the center with square shape publish we add condition we say enter site then it's a publish okay so now if we visit this space aha uh -huh. so you see the footer is there let's make some changes we should probably delete this update done awesome right